One of the biggest fires ever seen in the West Midlands, fueled by 10,000 tonnes of recycling material. At one stage, 200 firefighters were required to try to bring this massive blaze under control. 13 suffered minor injuries. Two of those needed a hospital checkup. And all because of a single Chinese lantern, apparently captured on CCTV, landing on the building. We don't want to be party poopers, but when you get a six million pound fire, fire engines here for three days, uh, because you know, if you put fire in the sky and it lands on something combustible, that's what you get. So we think sensible people need to have a sensible conversation about doing the right thing. The one that landed in Smethwick last night looks to have caused what firefighters call a deep-seated blaze, affecting an area of 300 metres by 300 metres. They've been working with diggers to try to cool down the core of the blaze. It could take a couple of days. The Chinese lanterns are often used for celebrations or to mark the passing of a loved one. Farming organisations and safety groups have lobbied for them to be banned altogether. According to the Women's Food and Farming Union, an estimated 200,000 such lanterns are released in the UK every year leading to the deaths of livestock and damage to property. And although many have now had the wire structures changed to bamboo, campaigners claim they're still dangerous. We had one that um, landed on um, a hay barn. We don't have a house near this hay barn. Um, and so that could have been potentially very dangerous. My daughter and husband found one on the top of a t petrol tank in stone on Boxing Day. And, you know, it, it's just we don't know where it's going to end. Despite efforts to make them safer, there's growing concern about Chinese lanterns. And if you look at the instructions, they're pretty restrictive. It says here they must not be released within a five mile radius of farmers fields and livestock and not within two miles of a major road or motorway. And apparently you should also contact the Civil Aviation Authority to check airspace safety in your area. This is what one has been capable of causing. A swathe of industrial land in the middle of a major conurbation laid waste and still burning. David Crabtree, Sky News, Smethwick.